Well, at Sauter Village, we like to immerse our guests in history and help them learn while they're having fun. So it's a chronological immersion in history from the, the time Ohio became a state all the way up to the beginning of what they call the modern era, which is the 1920s, the Roaring Twenties. Kim Krieger is the media relations manager here at Souter, and uh, we're at the barn restaurant, right. obviously, because it looks Absolutely. like a barn. It does look like a barn. It's I beautiful. love the character in here. Uh, you're used to telling people about this place, but I want to know personally, like, how much do you enjoy working out here and being a part of this village? So many great stories to tell. Um, you know, when Erie started Souter Village back in 1976, he wanted to preserve the history, the heritage of not only what we have in the historic village, but also places like this, you know, the barn, restaurant. He wanted to preserve, um, you know, the home style food and make sure things like this continued. Uh, the hospitality, you know, we just want to welcome people from across the country, around the world, to Souter Village and experience all that we have to offer. I mean, we have three plates in front of us. But I'm looking at this and this looks like, you know, a homestyle dinner. That is a homestyle dinner. And I think when people say, I I'm going to go to the barn restaurant and enjoy um, a meal, this is what a lot of people would think of. And uh, we're going to head to the 1920s Main Street and you're going to hand off to someone else that's going to tell us a little bit about that. Who's going to tell us about the 1920s right. Main Street? So at the 1920s Main Street, we will be you guys will be talking with uh, Debbie Souter David. She is our president CEO. Uh, Erie Souter's granddaughter, mm -hmm. very much has her grandfather's vision for the future and looking at new and interesting and exciting ways to share the Souter Village story. And we might get a drink at the Speakeasy too. Hi, I'm Debbie, the president and CEO of Souter Village here in Archibald. We are on the new 1920s Main Street here at Souter Village. This is the culmination of our walk through time experience. We have a candy shop, the Main Street Confections, where behind there, of course, is the secret passage to the Prohibition Speakeasy for some after hours fun. So I've made my way into the secret speakeasy in the back of Main Street Confections. I'm keeping it quiet. Although you don't have to keep it quiet back here because we're pretty much secured in here. This is very hidden away. David, David, right? Absolutely. You're my bartender for today. I run the Broken Barrel Speakeasy here at the 1920s Main Street uh, at 86 Main Street, Souter Village, USA. Well, when, when folks come in for the speakeasy experience, we, we really want them to understand the history. Um, it's amazing how many people really truly don't understand what went on during those 13 years of prohibition. So we, we talk about the purpose of prohibition, what, what caused it to, to take place, and then why was it a, a huge failure. And then we lead people through uh, a tasting profile of some of our signature bourbons here at the Broken Barrel. This is a cool added experience to taking the tour. This is something, what, this is a weekend thing where people added on to the 1920s tour? Well, when for the remainder of this uh, historic uh, village season, we're, we're open on Fridays and Saturdays during the day. Um, when they pay for their admission to into the village, they can pay an additional fee to come in and be a part of this speakeasy experience. Here at Souter Village on the Main Street, we've taken great care to make it very authentic to the communities that we have in our area. In fact, many pieces of the buildings are actually architectural features that came from buildings in communities around us. Well, at Souter Village, we like to immerse our guests in history and help them learn while they're having fun. You know, they're having fun and they don't even realize they're learning. But our costume interpreters are, are instructed and taught to talk about the themes of history, talk about how it's all connected. Um, what was going through the lives and the minds of the people that lived during that era? And that's why at Souter Village we've worked hard to create this walk through time experience. So it's a chronological immersion in history from the, the time Ohio became a state all the way up to the beginning of what they call the modern era, which is the 1920s, the Roaring Twenties. Well, I am truly excited about this 1920s. If you, if you haven't caught that already, uh, this is really the culmination of my personal dream and the continuation of the 20-year master plan that we've been working on since I came back to help continue my grandfather's dream for the future. It's amazing, and then to see people enjoy it. You know, we, we had so much excitement and hope for this 1920s in 2020. And we're so glad that even in spite of the delays and the COVID and the restrictions, that we were able to open and give people a chance to have fun in the past and really make new memories and enjoy just a day, a getaway, a different perspective and, and learn something new.